What is up? What is up, everyone? We are on the run today. One Aquafunks fish right here. He just sent them out two days ago. Got to go to the building and pick them up. I am selling the 93 acrylic. Someone's on the way to get it in about an hour. So I have an hour to get to Atlanta and come back home. I've been tearing this up for about two or three hours now. And uh, yeah, we got this guy tore up. It's gone and we got more stuff coming in guys. I'm super excited. So let's just go get these fish and then let's get this tank out of here and let's get moving. Let's get it. Okay. Busy day here at Andy's Angels, but we got to get going. I wish I could stay and talk to my mother a little, but I got these boxes and I got some people coming to my house here. So let's get to the house, unbox these guys, and sell that tank. This box right here has the fish. That smaller box right there has the uh, plants and stuff. So we're gonna take care of this one first, um, and then we'll look at the other one. <laughs> we are live. A lot of poop, bro. You gotta, you gotta let these fish sit a little longer. Not just two days, you need like three or four. A lot of poop. But everyone's good. I'm gonna set them right here for now. Or should I should I acclimate them? Should I set them in here? Should I just throw them all in here? No, I'm just kidding. Alright. Here's number two. He put little band-aids over them and everything. Oh, he went the extra mile this time. Everyone is alive. A lot of poopy. That's a beautiful fish. Yeah, fuck. That one, that one didn't make it. This guy right here, yep, he, he's dead. He didn't make it, so only three, four made it. Sorry, bro. What else we got? So you guys can see, he went the extra mile with these guys. We got these guys wrapped <laughs> in their own paper towels. This is awesome. So here we go. What are these? Oh my goodness. These are the baby, um... A brain fart. These are baby Kerbenses. Um, now that I think about it. Actually, I don't. I lied. I had to call Aquafunk and ask him. <laughs> um, this bag is looking low of water, but no leaks. At least not from here. Yeah, no leaks. Everyone's alive. One, two, three, four. We got four, five. We got six in here, awesome. Everyone's alive. Alive! We're all alive! Who's leaking water? This guy, this guy's leaking water. How's this guy leaking water? Anyways. Let's check these other guys out. Some more Cabensis. My guy, you are full of them. Two bags of Cabensis. Now guys, keep in mind, all these fish will be going in the pond. This is where I'm gonna keep them. In the pond with these babies. Let's try this other guy. Let's see what we got in here. Keep in mind, I'm also waiting on some guys to come get the whole 93 gallon setup. Ooh. I take it these are those little zebra angels that stay little. These are cool. Is that it? Yep, that's it. No more. So either. this looks extremely well packed. I believe there's snails in here too. We'll check nice this out. It's full of snails that he had sent me. I don't know exactly what kind of snails, but you can see they crawled out and everything. So yeah. We got plant full of snail, a big ball of it. Ooh, hefty, hefty, I can knock someone out with this. And I believe it's another hefty thing of java moss. Awesome! What do we have in here? Oh, I know what these are. Over here, we got these big boys. I don't know what they are, I can't remember. I'm really bad with names, so don't kill me or don't blame me. We got this guy, which looks like jungle valve. 
but I don't know. Or Amazon Sword? No, I have Amazon Sword. This doesn't look like Amazon Sword. What is this? More snails. And some more jungle valve or something. We got two different plants here, which is awesome. And then we got more right here. So I'm not gonna open this because it's more of the same plants. Let's go ahead and acclimate these guys, plant these plants and uh, get them moving. So we got all of them in this tank floating. If it's one thing I learned with these breathable bags is that when you float them, you can't let them sink. You have to clip them with something above the water. So I'm using these little metal clips uh, to keep the bags uh, at least some off the water so they can still breathe. But we're gonna leave these guys for like 10, 15 minutes. They're coming for this tank. I'll be here at any time now. So while these guys acclimate, I'm gonna go ahead and get this tank out with the guys that are coming to pick it up. And uh, as soon as they're done, we'll let these guys off and I'll plant the rest of the plants, guys. So stay tuned and uh, I'll check in as soon as this gets done. And for the Let's last see. plant, this is a big one. Look at this thing. About as long as my arm. Jeez, bro. Now this is jan jungle valve. Hey, jungle valve or nah? <laughs> More of a plant. You probably, you guys are probably laughing at me right now. But what can I say? I'm not a plant kind of guy. I like my fish. But this looks really cool. This looks like jungle valve. What do you guys think? A bunch of floating plants too. So let's go ahead and get these guys in the tank, and we'll wait on the people to come get the fish thing. Bye bye goes to set up, you guys. Probably super creepy. That was probably the creepiest thing I've ever done. Record someone on their way out, but you do it for the YouTube guys. So we just got that sold. Now let's get um, Uncle Funk's fish out of those bags and into the tank. Okay. We, we got two of these guys and well this guy and that guy. There he is. They're not doing too bright, but we're still getting these guys out. I got a little bit of Java moss and I have four bags to go. Everyone's still alive, but that guy is concerning me, and so is that guy. All right, little update. We got all the angelfish in the tank, and now we just have the Crebensis. He's breathing a little hard. Hopefully he's okay. Let's get these guys in. Right? So there you guys have it. Here goes Uncle Funk's fish again. We got a bunch of Crebensis and we got a bunch of angelfish from him. Like I said, some of the marbles died. He just doesn't know it yet. They didn't really die. I'm just gonna steal them. But for now, everyone's doing okay. Crebensis are looking awesome in this little tank. You see a bunch of the poop and stuff that was in some of the bags, but everyone's doing awesome. I think that is it for now. We got this tank out of here. We got Aquafunks fishing. Everyone's doing awesome. I hope uh, the people that got this tank from me uh, can figure out how to put it together after I send them the video. And maybe they can send me a clip of the angelfish and whatever they have as a stocking for that tank once they get it together, guys. I hope you enjoyed this little video. Um, and if you haven't already, hit the like button if you made it this far. If you're not subscribed to my channel, Please make sure you do so because we got a lot, a lot of things coming, guys. You, you just couldn't even imagine the things we got coming for this channel. Until next time, guys, I'll catch you later and I'll see you in the next video. Peace, oh, peace. Wait, before you go, I forgot to show you guys the plants that he sent me. I got them planted, so let me show you. Went ahead and popped them in the 40 gallon long with the baby marbles. So I think they'll do all right. The lighting is not the best, but it's low light. And Aquafunk says he keeps his fish in fairly low light. So for now, I think these plants will be all right. These aren't dead, so if these ain't dead, I don't think those will die. Look at the water level. Got rid of some of my angelfish, which I'm happy. Um, so yeah, water change is coming soon. And now is really the end of this video, guys. See ya.